I am trying so hard not to fall asleep right now. My eyes are this close to closing. <sighs> Here's my problem. I love naps, except when I wake up from naps, I am in the grumpiest mood all day. I will just bang. <sighs> and so I have this internal struggle where it's like either be tired all day and make <laughs> or take a nap and be grumpy. I don't have any homework to do. I don't have any school to do. So it's like, technically I could take a nap because it's not like I have things to do, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm, <laughs> I'm literally so dumb, you guys. <laughs> okay. Are you ever reading a book or like watching a movie or something, but mostly reading a book and in the book it's like, <laughs> and in the book it's like, <laughs> I can't, I can't see it. I feel like such an idiot. <laughs> And in the book, it's like, it's like she was smirking. And like, you don't really think anything of it, but you're like reading the book, right? And then all of a sudden you notice, <laughs> all of a sudden you notice you're like smirking. You're like, and then you're like, what, what am I doing? Why am I making the same face expression? <laughs> the face expressions are so weird. Like, I feel like in a lot of books, they'll be like, they smiled, but it did not reach their eyes. And that line has always confused me because like, I know what it means. Like, you smiled, but it's not genuine. But like, you can't smile without reaching your eyes without looking so dumb. Like, you know what I'm saying? People smile without it reaching their eyes as much as they say they do in books. People would just look like idiots being like, all the time. You know what I'm saying? The swig fit. Today is a very special day. Some might even call it a holiday, okay? <laughs> I have been waiting to do this for so long, I cannot even tell you. I don't know why it took me so long to do it, but here I am, finally doing it. Okay, so you know how like when I vlog, like it's always like, the camera's always like, Where? in the car? Ah! I bought this to fix it, okay. Um, I opened it, so it's all ripped. But I finally bought a stand for my camera, so it doesn't go, Where? while I drive. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's so cute. Look at it. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Thoroughly clean desired mounting surface using cleaning wipe. It comes with a cleaning wipe. <sighs> I just want to put it like right here, like right in the middle so I can just like... Okay, so I put it on, but um, it's cricket. But it's fine, as long as it gets the job done. Now for the moment of truth. Ah. No! No, now it just shows the freaking thing! And I can't take it off! No! <laughs> Don't do this! Fixed it! Swig, here I come, okay? I don't know what all these extra little things are, but I'm just gonna stuff them in here. Hopefully they're not important. Whenever I'm driving, I put it on myself to play the best songs. Like really live up to my full potential. So with that being said. Thought Harry, that would fit. He would turn into a snake, of course. Legit, not even kidding. I've literally almost gone into a car crash. That was the scariest thing ever. Like I had to switch lanes so fast. <laughs> I'm just sitting here listening to my Harry Potter audible book in silence and the guy comes up to take my order. Oh my gosh! 444! It's an angel number! That's the price of the gas per gallon right now and that is an angel number. The awkward drive after you get your drink but you don't want to drive away until you have the straw in your drink. So you do that like slow, awkward pull out out of the drive through while you're trying to put your straw in your drink. <sighs> Bro, the journey to turn on the hot tub is literally pure death. So these are Brighton's shoes. I don't own Crocs, but... <sighs> to try to not get snow in your socks. <gasps> no! Oh, I got snow! No! No, I got my socks wet. Okay, I'm out here hot tubbing with my dad, and I found the best TikTok for us to make. If you're not following me on TikTok, what are you doing? What's better than one cover girl? Two cover girls. 
my worst fear is just like water like the ocean mm, mm, mm. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Dark water? No. Like if I'm boating, like if I'm in Lake Powell or like boating anywhere and it starts to get dark, immediate no. It makes me feel so panicky. I think there's a phrase for it. It's called like thalassophobia or something. Dark water. <laughs> Luckily the hot tub isn't too bad because I can like see the bottom. Like I know where the bottom is, but it's just like the depth of the creepy water. I hope I'm not the only one. Oh my gosh, that would be such a good question to ask people is what is what are their weird fears? Okay, next video. I have a friend who is literally scared of holes. Like she's just like everything holes just like scare her. She's like hair follicles, which is so interesting to me. I don't know. It's just so interesting people's different fears. I went on my Instagram and I asked them. I said, "Tell me anything. Tell me anything at all." So I would go through and kind of read those Instagram things and see what kind of comes of them someone said swimming is technically an extreme sport because if you don't swim you're gonna die which is true what i want you to do is i want you to rate my swimming on a scale from one to ten people tell me i have a pretty intense doggy paddle okay <coughs> um what did you think do you use to curl your hair I'm actually having a curl dilemma right now because so on TikTok people have been making fun of the way that girls in Utah curl their hair because girls in Utah they'll like curl their hair but then they'll have like the end pieces straight it's really weird I'll have to see if I can find a picture and everyone's making fun of them for it I have never done it like that actually just because I never learned how to do it like that I'm having a dilemma because curling hair at school like in Utah it's trending to have the end straight but then it's like is it really trending this next question is were you a directioner and I'm offended you would even ask that because of course I was a directioner. As a kid, it was not even funny. I had the most serious obsession with One Direction. Like it was, it was bad. I had a pretty bad obsession. Someone wants me to tell a story from middle school and I have a good one. So in middle school, I would have really bad anxiety attacks. Just middle school was the worst time of my whole entire life. I can't even stress it enough. So I remember I had an anxiety attack one morning before middle school and I had to go to my first class. So I'm just crying in my car and then I was like, I have to go. So I get out of my car and I'm like trying to like wipe away my tears. I'm walking into school and some girl comes up to me. She's like, are you Taylor Shumway? Which I always love when people come say hi. Like seriously, come say hi if you ever see me. I just remember feeling so embarrassed because I was just, I was just crying. I was like, yeah, I am. <laughs> like, she's probably like, who is this girl? Someone said they want me to record my day at school. Honestly, I, oh, I don't know, you guys. <laughs> I feel like, I feel like people at school would be like, who is this girl? I don't think people at school, I feel like it would just be weird. I don't know. I don't know. I think people at school would think it was really weird. Maybe I will. Maybe one day. This person said, have you ever been stung by a bee? Oh my gosh. Boy, do I have a story for you. When I was four years old, I was just playing in some random like rose bush or something. Then I got stung by 14 wasps. I think a doctor said at one point, you better not get stung by very many more wasps in your lifetime because that's not good. Someone said, what are your thoughts about goldfish? The very best goldfish is the extra cheddar goldfish. You know when they have like the little yummy cheddar powder things? That is where it's at. That is the best goldfish. Someone said they want me to do an Instagram controls the day video. I would love to do one of those videos. I already did that video, but I think it'd be really fun because I did it like two years ago. This is a very heated subject. Someone wants to know my opinion on Harry Styles. And I'm about to disappoint a lot of people. Harry Styles is not it. I'm sorry. He's not like I'm a Harry Styles hater, but... And it's not like I understand why he has the hype, but I guess he's just not... He's not my cup of tea. Help. <coughs> I'm literally scared. I was just hot to me. I swear there was someone. I swear there is someone in my backyard right now. Like I literally heard like howling go scary in my backyard is when it's dark. If you're out there, just come out, please. I'm sure it's fine. But if I die and like this is the last video of me, the worst part is that I'm literally not even kidding. I swear there's someone. Oh no, my camera's about to die. The worst part is that I was making TikToks when I heard the noises. If you don't cover your face in Aquaphor every night before bed, what are you even doing with your life? One time I went over to my friend's house for a sleepover and I washed my face before I got all ready and I show up. And she opens the door, she goes, 
whoa and i was like <laughs> sorry i forgot to tell you i cover my whole face and i'll go for it every night it's gonna be such a fun surprise for my husband when we get married i don't know how i made it to midnight without a nap but i did so